Consider the expression 1 to the power k, 2 to the power k, up to n to the power k. Here n is greater than or equal to 1 and k is odd. This is given information. Our goal is to show that this expression, let's call it s, our goal is to show that this is divisible by n into n plus 1 by 2, that is n into n plus 1 by 2 divides s. This is what we want to show. Now as usual the link in the description will contain all the hints and the final solution. But the first hint goes like this. So this is the first hint and it's like a major hint so that you can really try the problem. It's like this that uh, if you look at this expression s, you can write it in the other direction. So let's write a copy of s but write it in the other direction. And then we will be adding this up. So 2 times s is equal to 1 plus k n to the power k. We will group them up. 2 to the power k n minus 1 to the power k. Like this. We will go to the last one n to the power k plus 1 to the power k. Now there is a very nice formula that a to the power k plus b to the power k can be factorized if k is odd. One nice example of it, we all know this, that a cube plus b cube is a plus b times a square minus a b plus b square. So we can actually factorize this. The general formula is this is equal to a plus b a to the power k minus 1 minus b times a to the power k minus 2 plus b squared times a to the power k minus 3 etc. The last one would be b to the power k minus 1. How do we prove this? How do we prove this factorization? Well, you can use induction. Basically opening up this bracket and foiling the parentheses will also show you the result. Okay. Anyway, so we will use this formula directly. What this means is that a plus b, this quantity, divides a to the power k plus b to the power k. And this will be heavily used here because each of these quantities, 1 to the power k plus n to the power k using this formula is divisible by 1 plus n. Similarly, if you look at the second piece here, 2 to the power k plus n minus 1 to the power k is divisible by 2 plus n minus 1. This is also n plus 1. So each of these, each of these blocks is divisible by n plus 1. So we have 2 times s is equal to n plus 1 times some constant. Whatever the stuff is inside the parentheses. Those will all add up. So s is equal to n plus 1 divided by 2 times some constant. Now it will really depend if s is even or if s is odd. If s is odd or rather it would more depend on uh, we can write it like this actually if n is even if n is even then this division by 2 will go into this part and n plus 1 will divide s of course 2 will not divide n plus 1 the right left hand side is an integer so 2 must have divided this constant and n plus 1 must divide s. So if n is even, n plus 1 by is divisible, uh, it can divide s. If n is odd, if n is odd, then n plus 1 by 2 will surely divide s. We can just 
if n is odd then n plus 1 is even so we can divide by 2 and then that thing will divide s. So this is the conclusion we get from the first part of our analysis. The next thing we want to show and that's the clever part check the link in the description that n or n by 2 will divide s depending on whether n is even or odd and then you have to use the fact that the GCD of n and n plus 1 is always 1 to complete the solution. So try it yourself and the link in the description will take you to the remaining hints and the solution. But this is a very beautiful problem. It's from ISI entrance, but it is all, it, it also came in a Russian Olympiad. Um, more problems will come like this. Keep on doing great mathematics.